Thank you. Well, police are still looking for the person who torched this Wake County school bus Tuesday night. It happened in the Leesville High School parking lot. So we wanted to know what the district is doing to keep buses from being vandalized. CBS North Carolina investigates Jonathan Rodriguez is holding the school accountable tonight and joins us live at a bus lot in Raleigh. Jonathan. Yes, Sharon, this is one of 34 lots that Wake County has with more than 800 buses. So you do the math, right? Each bus costs tens of thousands of dollars. You multiply that out. We're talking millions of dollars that the school system has invested on getting kids to and from school. So we simply wanted to know, what are they doing to protect these buses? Is it adequate and is it necessary? Take a look. We visited about a third of those bus lots today and found almost every single one did not have a fence and did not have cameras in the actual lot. We even found some school buses with the doors left wide open. Some schools had cameras mounted that faced towards the lots, but there were very few. The largest lot Wake County has is off of Rock Quarry Road. There we did find fencing and barbed wire with cameras that are on site. The problem is the gate was left open where anybody could walk in. So we asked Wake County schools about these issues and if they felt there was adequate security when it comes to protecting the districts and the taxpayers' investment. They wouldn't talk to us on camera, but did issue a statement saying that all the buses are covered by insurance. They said they work closely with their security team and local law enforcement to prevent incidents of vandalism. They also said visitors are required to get permission before being on campus. Now, the Leesville bus fire is not the first one we've had, unfortunately. Over at Southeast Raleigh in 2014, they had several buses that police believe were intentionally set on fire, along with some reports of vandalism and even things like batteries being stolen. So it is an expensive investment to try to protect, Sharon.